So brand equity, looking at it as the, the general term, is really the value of your brand. So what this course does is we analyze brand equity but starting from the development of a brand, the maintenance of a brand, and then down to that actual measurement. So understanding your campaigns, um, the various facets of building a brand, and then finally looking at that brand equity and whether it's something that's valuable to the company and making sure that it is something that's very sustainable and forward looking. One way that effective brand management um, can actually maintain that long-term profitability of a company is really looking at it from a strategic focus. So starting with the business, um, being aligned with the business objectives, and then looking at your various partners, so your advertising partners, your marketing partners, as well as your agency partners. With that well-blended communication, you're able to really maintain uh, your messaging and make sure that all of the communications that are going out are um, aligned with your business objectives as well as your branding objectives. This is a very interesting question and we go into it a little bit further when we go into the third week of the course. The idea is that you always wanna make sure that you're adaptable. You wanna make sure that you're consistent with your messaging. You wanna be well blended across all three segments, marketing, advertising, as well as public relations. For my course, the top three skills include thinking critically. The next would is to be able to uh, develop a strategy, develop a branding strategy, if you will. So what we look at in the second to fourth week is actually the specific steps of developing a brand, from creating your, your stakeholder map all the way down to analyzing whether or not your campaigns during that, that rebranding initiative or the developing of a brand um, were successful. And then finally, it's to be creative. So um, one of the biggest aspects of, of building a brand is to look at things through a new lens. It's not through you know, following your competitors and you know, if they're shifting to, to um, having a more casual conversation, but your business doesn't have that, that's not who you are to your core, um, then you shouldn't be moving that way. And the, the idea is just be creative and figure it out on your own and, and use your communications um, lens to, to give a new perspective on things.